Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about a fairly common fault code that can pop up on your OBD2 scanner, P0508, low idle air control circuit value. Now, this code can be a bit of a head scratcher, so I'm going to break it down for you in this video. We'll talk about what the code means, what can cause it, and how to diagnose and fix it. So, if you're seeing this code on your car, Stick around and I'll help you get it sorted out. The P0508 code is a diagnostic trouble code, DTC, that indicates a problem with the idle air control, IAC, circuit. The IAC valve is responsible for controlling the amount of air that bypasses the throttle plate at idle. This allows the engine to maintain a consistent idle speed, even when there are changes in load, such as when the air conditioner is turned on. When the P0508 code is set, it means that the powertrain control module, PCM, has detected a low voltage in the IAC circuit. This could be caused by a number of factors, including a faulty IAC valve, a wiring problem, or a problem with the PCM itself. There are a number of potential causes of the P0508 code. Some of the most common causes include, faulty IAC valve. The IAC valve is a common failure point for this code. The valve can become stuck open or closed, which can cause the engine to idle too high or too low. Wiring problem. A wiring problem can also cause the P0508 code. The wiring to the IAC valve can become damaged or corroded, which can prevent the valve from receiving the correct voltage. Problem with the PCM. In some cases, the P0508 code can be caused by a problem with the PCM. The PCM is responsible for controlling the IAC valve, so if the PCM is malfunctioning, it can cause the valve to operate incorrectly. If you are experiencing the P0508 code, it is important to have it diagnosed and repaired by a qualified mechanic. The code can cause a number of problems, including poor fuel economy, rough idle, and stalling. In some cases, the code can also cause the engine to run too lean, which can damage the catalytic converter. Here are some additional tips for diagnosing and repairing the P0508 code. Check the wiring to the IAC valve for any damage or corrosion. Test the IAC valve to see if it is operating correctly. If the IAC valve is faulty, replace it. If the wiring is damaged, repair or replace it. If the PCM is malfunctioning, it will need to be replaced. By following these tips, you can diagnose and repair the P0508 code and get your vehicle back on the road. The P0508 code is a common OBD2 trouble code that indicates a problem with the idle air control, IAC, circuit. The IAC valve is responsible for controlling the amount of air that bypasses the throttle plate at idle. This allows the engine to maintain a consistent idle speed even when the engine is under load. When the P0508 code is set, it means that the IAC circuit is not functioning properly. This can cause a variety of symptoms, including, rough idle, the engine may idle erratically or stall. High idle, the engine may idle at a higher than normal RPM. Poor fuel economy, the engine may use more fuel than usual. Black smoke from the exhaust, this is a sign that the engine is running rich which means that it is getting too much fuel. If you are experiencing any of the symptoms listed above, it is important to have the P0508 code diagnosed by a qualified mechanic. The mechanic will use a diagnostic scanner to retrieve the code from the engine control module, ECM. They will then use a variety of tests to determine the cause of the problem. Some of the tests that the mechanic may perform include, inspecting the IAC valve, the mechanic will visually inspect the IAC valve for any signs of damage or wear. Testing the IAC valve, the mechanic will use a multimeter to test the IAC valve for proper operation. Checking the wiring and connectors, the mechanic will check the wiring and connectors for any signs of damage or corrosion. The repair for the P0508 code will vary depending on the cause of the problem. If the IAC valve is damaged or worn, it will need to be replaced. If the wiring or connectors are damaged, they will need to be repaired or replaced. In some cases, the problem may be caused by a software issue with the ECM. If this is the case, the ECM will need to be reprogrammed. Once the repair is complete, 
the mechanic will clear the P0508 code from the ECM. The engine should then run normally. The P0508 code is a relatively common problem, but it can be difficult to diagnose. If you are experiencing any of the symptoms listed above, it is important to have the code diagnosed by a qualified mechanic. Here are some additional tips for diagnosing and repairing the P0508 code. Use a high-quality diagnostic scanner. A good diagnostic scanner will be able to retrieve the P0508 code and provide you with additional information about the problem. Consult a repair manual. A repair manual will provide you with step-by-step -step instructions on how to diagnose and repair the P0508 code. Be patient. Diagnosing and repairing the P0508 code can be time-consuming, so be patient and don't give up.